Hey, what's up? Welcome back. In this video, I want to show you how you can set up a page for the homepage for your WordPress website. So in my case, I have this website and you can see that this is the homepage for the website. This is the basic URL. And when you go to that, you can see this page is loaded. And in this quick tutorial, I want to show you how you can set up a page as the homepage for your WordPress website. So it's very easy to do. I will show you the steps. Before I'll uh, show you that, I want to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed to the channel because at this moment we are at 502 subs. So for me, that's quite of a milestone. I know compared to the huge YouTube channels, it's not a lot. But the way I look at it is if you put all those 502 people in one room, then you have quite of a large crowd. So I'm very thankful for that. So if you haven't subscribed already, make sure you do. So thanks for that. And I haven't uploaded any new videos for about two months or so because I've been quite busy with my own projects. But I have received a lot of thankful messages on my videos. And I must say that it quite motivates me to continue to create videos for you guys. And as always, I want to make sure that my videos are very straightforward, very simple to follow and with no fluff or any other unnecessary info into it. So with that being said, let's dive straight into it. So what you need to do is you have to go to the WordPress dashboard, go to the pages section. And here you can see all the pages that I have created for my website. And in this case, you can see it's seven pages, but a couple of them like this one, this one, and this one are set to private. So there are pages that I have created in the past that I don't have online right now. So you can't view them. Maybe I will delete them, but I'm not sure about it. So I've set them to private in case I want to use them later on in the future. So the only pages that I have uh, active right now is this one, the all tutorial categories, the home page, the resources page and the web hosting page. And for the home page, it speaks for itself. This is the page that I've created as the home page for my website. So that is this page. So you can give it any name you want to. So I called it home because I want to set it as the home page, but you can give it any name you want to. And the way that you can set up a page as the home page for your website is as follows. First, you need to go to the settings options of course you must have created a page first so that's the first step you have to do i won't show you how to do that in this video because i've uh, made other tutorials that show you exactly how you can create pages and also create posts but you can only set the home page for a page of your website so keep that in mind <clears throat> so the first step is that you have to create a page and like i said you can name it anything you want to but after you have created the page then you need to go to the settings option over here and you need to go to the reading option. If you click on that, now you can see the first option is your homepage displays. And what you need to do over here is you need to select the option aesthetic page. So that means that aesthetic page is being shown as the homepage for your website when visitors go to the regular URL. So in my case, it's websitelearninglab.com. So over here at the home page box, you can click on it and there you can see all the pages that you have created that are active. So in my case, I just named four pages, the all tutorial categories, the home page, the resources and the web hosting. And like I mentioned, I have set the home page to be displayed as the actual home page for my website. But let's say I want to select the resources pages and I want to show that as the home page of my website. I could select that. And of course, you need to save the changes. So click on the blue save changes button. And if you do that, then in my case, now this page will be shown as the home page of my website. Of course, I don't want to do that. I want to keep it on the home page. So I'll set it to home. But this is the only thing that you have to do to set up a page as the home page for your website. So a quick summary is first step is you have to go to the pages option. You need to create a page. After that, you go to the settings option. Then you click on the reading option. 
and at the option at the uh, at the top of the page it says your home page displays here you need to select a static page and the last step is you just need to select which page that you want to display as the home page for your website and then of course click on save changes so that's it I hope this video was helpful. It's a video for beginners for WordPress. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, also leave a thumbs up and I would appreciate it if you would leave a comment. I read all the comments and if there are any questions, please make sure to let me know also and I will try my best to help you out by replying to your comments or I will make a video about it. And with that being said, thanks again for watching and I hope to see you back again in the next video.